¿Cómo andan los Thundercats? ¿Qué se cuenta, loco? ¿Todo bien? Seguimos con la locura esta. Eh, teníamos un montón de misiones para hacer en esta nave. Eh, quiero arreglar el tema del calor, así que voy a ir a buscar las piezas. La tenemos que ir a buscar a una zona que era medio peligrosa dentro de, de esta nave. Así que vamos. De paso está bueno, probamos la armadura. Oh, de una, ¿eh? Is this what carbon monoxide poisoning looks like? I don't think this deck is too well ventilated. Uh, speaking for myself, Captain, I am not of a mind to be murdered by a psychopath who plays with fire. You came with the crew. Welcome. We got plenty of space to spread out, but only room for one captain. You stumbled into my court without an invitation, neighbor from above. If you don't have any business, then it's time to light up the grill. Atacamos nomás. Arma re satánica. Loco, los pulverizan. El problema es que no encuentro los restos. Sí, sí, me encanta, me encanta. Me encanta. Oh, me encanta levantar todo, no me importa nada. Eh... ¿Qué más, eh? ¿Esto qué es? ¿Están arriba?
<ríe> Pensé que era la, la nuca cola. <ríe> la nuca cola. Bueno, por acá nada. Ya que subir. Vamos a grabar. Porque internet sigue malito. comí una pizza, mamá, está activando, está activando mi cuerpo lo peor de mí, está surgiendo, me están haciendo un Shen Long en el estómago, Dios mío, cuando tengo que ir al baño, loco. Parece que del lado de enfrente había otras escaleras. Pensé que se conectaba todo. Pero no. Mira, un pedazo de hacha que hay acá. No quiero abrir nada porque una de las misiones era robar no sé qué cosa de un tenía que entrar en una puerta que no podía, la tenías que hackear. Entonces prefiero evitar. Ah, por acá. No, se me quedó colgado. Ah. 
Bueno, estamos bien, ¿eh? Bueno, la armadura, esto es lo que yo quería ver, la armadura que tenemos, más los acompañantes. Uf. Perdonen si se cuelga. Necesito internet para transmitir lo de la play, así que... Pero bueno, nada. Si, si se cuelga muy feo... Ahora salió rápido. Si se cuelga muy feo, yo siempre corto el video y seguimos. Rápido. Nada, para ustedes son tres segundos. Eh, a darle, ¿no? Ya me voy a comprar la, la capturadora. Y conecto todo punto a punto y listo. You've returned, and in one good work. I'll take those. I need you to head through the large door at the far end of engineering. Take the elevator down into the machinery shaft. There's a terminal in the back. Activate it when I call over the ship's PA. And bring weapons. There's a slight man to pillar infestation. More than a few, less than a hive. Nothing you can't handle. We were salvaging parts. Don't worry, Miss Junlei. We'll be super gentle with the ship. You don't got a thing to worry about. I mean, aside from fires and such. I'm genuinely heartened to hear that. Thank you. La que la tenías que arreglar vos, la cosa. ¿Qué clase de ingeniera sos? Sí, por acá tengo que ir. Ah, se me abrió esta puerta. Vamos a guardar por las dudas. Enemigos, eh. Siempre el camino corto es el que está cerrado.
Bichitos. ¿Sabes qué? Tengo mi duda. El otro día lo escuché a un youtuber hablar de esto. Que dependiendo del juego. Dependiendo del juego se puede colgar más la transmisión. Por ejemplo, yo ahora estoy, no sé, con este juego. ¿sí? Estoy transmitiendo por Wi-Fi, estoy conectándome con la Play y, y transmitiendo. Pero um, si yo jugara a un juego más, más tranquilo, no sé, le pongo un... O sea, algo que no consuma tanto gráfico. ¿Qué puede ser? Un Minecraft. No, pero la otra vez jugamos Minecraft y se me colgaba igual. No sé si dependerá también del juego. My boys are returning to green. What a weight that is off my shoulders. I don't normally tolerate outsiders mucking about in my station's guts, but you're all right. The temperature should be dropping as we speak. I'll see to it the crew knows who kept us all from boiling alive. If you've got time, I believe Edna has a comms issue that could use your attention. I've also authorized Doc and Furu to sell you our premium meds. Ah, qué bueno, gracias. Frustrating. Everything down to the circuit boards is past warranty, so I have the pleasure of making life or death decisions on a shoestring budget. Plus, there's no time to train my successor or document fixes in a way that anyone outside the family would understand. Sure is. The Tennysons came over on the groundbreaking. My grandmother, Chief Gaying, kept it together during a crossing and until she died. I was promoted only recently, when my mom died. Then I took the leap from Chief Engineer to Captain. They must have been amazing people to have taught you all you know, I mean, which is a lot. That means a lot coming from a fellow engineer. It was different knowing that I couldn't turn to anyone who could answer the tough questions for me. Maybe you can see why I'm protective of Groundbreaker. This ship is family. It's got tinkerings and bypasses that only Tennysons know about. Oh, gosh. I don't know. I'm really just a, a dab hand with a wrench. Nothing special. Not like a chief engineer. Don't sell yourself short. 
It doesn't take a seasoned pro to tinker on Groundbreaker. Just someone who knows how a ship ought to feel. We're always thirsting for help. If you could find your way around this labyrinth of ducks and panels, we could work something out. I hope that was a joke, Captain. I really do. I gelded that thing years ago. Now it brews a stim that goes down stronger than Nan or Spank. Family recipe. You see any bite-sized Tennyson children running around? I didn't think so. The next captain won't... You got my attention. You're right, I don't. The board is after two things, bits and power. La and they como, by sticking their nose where it doesn't como belong. Como el imperio, más o menos, ¿no? Debe haber un Darth Vader por ahí. Rompiendo las bolas. I like to think of myself as a nice person, but if that gaudy embassy of his was on fire, I might hold my breath a moment before activating the sprinkler system. The board wants control over Groundbreaker, and leeches like Udon Bedford will do anything to please their corporate masters. I placate them when I have something to offer, but I can also be a real hard ass. It'd be a joy if I could kick out the corporate merchants and reclaim the docking fees in my lifetime. Too much of Groundbreaker's in got my attention. Bueno, menos Charlie y más acción. This is Halcyon News. We interrupt your regularly scheduled advertisement for the following story. Concerned citizens often ask why there aren't enough new faces in the Halcyon colony. We all want new neighbors from time to time. Our studies have shown that a controlled population is inversely Talentos. Uno, dos. Uno, dos en defensa, uno en diálogo, uno en sigilo, uno en tecnología, uno en liderazgo. El otro, el ante, la anterior vez creo que fue cuerpo a cuerpo y defensa. Ahora hace cuerpo a cuerpo y distancia. Bien. Tengo 9700 bits. ¿Qué significa eso? Que... Cuando junte 10, voy a poder hacer algo. <ríe> ah, mira, tengo un casco nivel 16. Creo que Parvati tiene un casco nivel 16. Y el Vicario tiene un casco nivel 11. Y ya tenés guachín. Pasa que me da un bloqueo más 5. Ah, no importa. Ah, oh, Diario. ¿Será que la podemos hacer ahora esta? Tenía que abrir una puerta, una terminal, era medio... Bueno, igual nos queda de pasada para ir a la nave. O podríamos hacer el de la... La doctora. Y está acá nomás. say I've seen you before. I take it you're a freighter, Captain? If you're here to better yourself, you'll have to wait. We're having a spot of trouble with our delivery service. Did he now? A mouth on that man. I swear his late mother'd be ashamed. He must be referring to Erion. I'm sure the fool's gotten himself into another scrape. I'm beginning to wonder if I'm ever going to get my service mechanicals at this rate. Our delivery man. A brave idiot with a penchant for getting himself delayed. Sometimes by dates, usually by bandits. Surgery mostly. Medical personnel are difficult to come by on Groundbreaker. The board won't let their doctors and nurses station here, and they own all the medical schools. 
If we can't hire their people, we can't hire anyone. Everyone on staff here on ground... I'd be grateful if you'd spare the time. We need his delivery soon as yesterday. Last he told me, he was taking a shortcut by Scylla, an asteroid in the Charybdis cluster. That's where I'd start, were I the adventuring type. You look out, though. The place is probably crawling with outlaws. Bueno. Otra misión que me pide salir. Is it just me? Uh, have a look. Bien. Cuatro, treinta y ocho, es un cañón de descarga ese. Está lindo este, ¿eh? Cortador de plasma. Bueno, martillo de impacto, cincuenta y ocho, cincuenta y ocho, chao, cincuenta, chao. Esto es chatarra. Me ha llegado la 10 luquita. Eh, voy a ver si puedo hacer esa misión de. Si puedo abrir la puerta ahora con algún objeto que tenga. No, me falta habilidad para, para abrir acá. ¿Qué es esto? Bueno, no. Bueno, vamos a la pionera. Hey there, Captain. Anything I can do for you? Be seeing you. Ah, vamos a comprarle. Pasa que me quedo sin nada. Si le compro.
¿Dónde estaba? It's almost time for today's episode of the Chairman's Children. Care to with me? Tengo los diez mil. Pero me quedo. Fantastic. Do be careful with it, dear, as these keys tend to be a tad hard to acquire. You should have a chat with Lilia Hagen in the sublight offices. She's a tear. You'll love her. Now, was there anything else? What do you want, then? My heart? That's right, dearie. The only independent station in the colony. That's us. Though for how long, I can't say. That all depends on the... The board can't abide a community that won't bend to its will. Go right ahead, sweet. Oh, a little of this, a little of that. I buy and sell items that require discretion to dispose of. Knickknacks. Curios. I also knit throw pillows stuffed with the hair of famous tossball players. But that's more of a passion project. I'm not sure that's entirely legal. That's half the reason I make them, my dear. But that's not what you wanted to talk about, is it, dear? Ask the common folk, and they'll tell you it's on account of all the monsters on Monarch desperate to gobble you up. Because that's what the board tells them, you see. I think they made some fool mistake that would make them look bad to the rest of the colony, and they're trying to hide the evidence. Those board folk are real prideful-like. Never want you looking behind the curtain, lest you see their derrieres. But old Gladys knows the score. The whole colony's not much more than a diorama, showcasing one board screw up after another. That's why we gotta keep them from getting their grubby mitts on Groundbreaker. Probably. Every once in a while, we get these snippets of rage. Con la almohada atrás. Some man hooting and hollering about the light in us all. Ah, Dios. Who he's transmitting from Monarch? But who knows if that's true? Might be true. Might be some new trick bueno, chao, from the board. Any time, sweetheart. You know where to find me. Here, take a candy with you. No sé qué es el corazón de Lilo. No sé. No sé qué. No sé qué es y no sé qué es. Eh, me dio para hablar con alguien de acá adentro. Está por acá. Monarch is a wretched hive of terrorism and anarchy. We best top off our ammo stock before we leave. It's not here. How good it is. Sublight salvage. Their front looks surprisingly on the up and up. You reckon we can shop here or is it all smoke for? Welcome to Sublight Salvage and Shipping, a legitimate business for legitimate consumers. You the one flying the unreliable? Miss Lily has been expecting you. I'll unlock the door. Sure am. A few years back, they got me started on simple acquisitions. You know those latches they put on cargo bays ain't worth a damn? These days, I stick... So you're the new captain in town. I was hoping you'd make your way to my office. Saves me the work of hunting you down. Lilia Hagen, CEO and executive director of Aggressive Operations. Hijo capitán de la ciudad. Know about Sublight, otherwise you wouldn't have come. ¿En qué momento me transformé en capitán de todo eso? Charmed. It's nice to see the unreliable again. A useful ship. Hawthorn was my contractor. I'd recognize that leaky boat of his anywhere. Mm -hmm. 
Is Ada still at the helm? I don't know how many times I told Hawthorne to restore that smartass to factory settings. I have a salvage job for someone light on corporate ties with a reliable set of wings. But there's a catch. There is always a catch. If you have a nav key to Stellar Bay, the job's yours. Interested? One of my guys in Stellar Bay has a lead on some high-grade salvage, but he went dark before he could spill the goods. We arranged a drop at the Saltuna Warehouse's loading dock. Find whatever he left there and take it to Fallbrook. My gal Catherine will be expecting you. A few of my contractors run flights in there and out again, working around the board embargo. We keep the community lubricated with a steady supply of booze and unconventional erotica. Byzantium kids with more money than sense can thank Sublight for their good time. One of my guys filmed a raptodon grinding on an auto mech. Didn't end well for anyone, including the cameraman. When the board pulled out of Monarch, they buried or sealed anything they couldn't carry off world. Apparently. Now get going. Catherine will brief you on the details when you check in with her at Fallbrook. One last thing. When you're on the job, keep a pair of eyes in the back of your head. Understood? You'll do fine. Probably nothing to worry about. Probably. Well, that set me at ease. Bueno, nivel 10. Tenemos talentos y ventajas. Eh... Bueno, lo mismo. Necesito 30 en cerrajería para intentar abrir esa puerta y entrar y hackear el... Listo, ya está. Es un juego, loco. Amor y pan. Ah, ya puedo, ya puedo jugar con la de abajo. Eso está bueno, eh. La mira se me va al carajo cuando apunto. Uh, bien. Bueno, lo quito. Tenemos mucho para hacer. Let us take heed that we are not caught failing the law. I am not keen on another long term penitentiary assignment. El cura ya tuvo en cana. BNP Borson Baked Beans. 
Mira. Bien, tenemos un poder de carga de 170 ahora. Fancy running into you again. Don't mind me. It's just admiring your ship from up close. Gotta hand it to you, boss. That's a fine looking ship. Only thing it's missing is me. Yes, I absolutely am. Just give me a shot. That's all I'm asking. I could be the best damn crew you ever hired. You're serious. You're giving me a shot. All right. Uh, hang on. Hang on. I put together a little speech, just in case you asked. Hey there, I'm Felix Millstone. I have prepared a list of reasons why I believe you should hire me to join the crew of your ship and or outlaw gang. Firstly, I am highly personable, and I get along well with anyone who is not of the jackass persuasion. <laughs> I'm sorry. He's funny. Uh, secondly, I can be counted on in the event of a firefight, standoff, and or raid. My motto is, if you need a steady gun hand, I'm your man. That motto is a, it's a work in progress. Additionally, I have several years of experience as a box hauler. This skill may come in handy if you need a body dragged away or a door held open while escaping enemy fire. In conclusion, Thank you for considering me for your ship crew and or outlaw gang. I look forward to our adventures together. I thought that was real good, Felix. Thanks for the vote of confidence. What do you think? Am I in? Wow. <laughs> you don't know how long I've been waiting to hear that. Thanks, boss. You're not gonna regret this. I'll just gather my personals and meet you on board. This is gonna be great. Really? We're picking up strays now? Look at that. A real vicar. <laughs> I'm sure we'll get along like a church on fire. El vicario no me está cayendo muy bien, eh? Por un lado te dice una cosa, amor y paz, loco. Y por otro lado, tiene unos comentarios re sorete, chao. Que me está gustando el juego, ¿eh? A mí me está gustando. No es un mundo abierto full, full, full. Tiene ahí un minimapa con los planetas para donde tenés que ir. Y bueno. Welcome aboard, Captain. Welcome back, Captain. Now that you have acquired a nav key to Stellar Bay, would you like me to contact Dr. Wells? Well done. You'll love Monarch. Exotic climate, violent native species, fascinating culture, really. You'll need to speak with Hiram Blythe. He's known as the information broker, and for good reason. If anyone knows where I can find those chemicals, it's Hiram. I need those chemicals to revive the Hope's colonists. They can help us fight back against the board. They can help us set things right. If we don't put a stop to the board, they're going to drive this colony toward a complete societal collapse. You'll see what I mean when you arrive on Monarch. <laughs> no, never. Monarch is a hotbed of political activity. I can't imagine why Hiram set up shop there. Cuisine, perhaps? You'll want to hire the services of a skilled guide. I recommend a hunter by the name of Nioka. Frequents the drinking establishments of Stellar Bay. Very hard to miss. Once you have everything you need, make your way to Hiram Blythe's compound. Come see me in my lab. I'll answer any questions you have. Best of luck. Everyone on the Hope is counting on you. 
Bueno. Bueno, estoy ahí. Esta es la otra misión. Ah, quería preguntar. Ahí está. Acá hay otra misión también. ¿Dónde están locos todos? ¿Se fueron a la goma? Este es Marbate. Hey, Captain. Can I get your temperature on something real quick? So, June Lei and I have been talking some. Through messages, I got him here on my data pad, and well, she sent me a poem. One she wrote her own self, I'm pretty sure. I don't know if I should read into it, because poems are all symbolic and such, right? It's not so good, but real sweet. Oh, Law, that's what's got me spooked. I don't rightly know. It's about this engine that's been shaking itself apart. Then this lady mechanic comes by and lays one hand on it. And the trouble goes away. It sings. I don't want to get too hopeful, but I'm wondering if maybe she's the engine and I'm the lady. It's a real romantic poem. It made my chest hurt, kinda. I don't know where it's leading yet or if I'm misinterpreting. I'm not much interested in physical stuff. Never have been. Leastways, not like other folks seem to be. It's not that I can't. I just don't care for it. It's been a problem in the past. The folk who wanted to be with me back in the Vale, they didn't... They said I was cold. Thanks, Captain. That makes me feel a touch better. I actually had another message from June Lei. I just couldn't work up the courage to open it. But I'm gonna change that. Right now. Okay, here we go. Let's see here. Talking about old friends, got to thinking. Isabel. Who's. Who's Isabel? They were. close, Captain. More than friends close. I don't know. June Lei talked about them like it was past, but how far in the past? Ten years? Last week? Captain, I'm feeling all mixed up right now. Could we maybe head to the Groundbreaker? Get some drinks at that bar there? The Lost Hope? Come on, Captain. This is no time to be fooling on me. I'm full serious. Next time we're on the Groundbreaker, I aim to get a drink. If I got to, I'll do it on my lonesome. But I'd feel better if someone I trusted was there. Bueno. Tengo a esta.
les queda como el orto la combinación. Ah, le pongo lo que encuentro, después veo. Si, si alguno me deja, me abandona. Esta, esta mina tiene pinta que me va a dejar en pelota en cualquier momento. Se va a ir con la otra. Eh, che, ¿puedo mejorar algo? Bueno. Reparar, se sí, copa. Modificar. Me da más dureza, ¿no? Estamos bien. Bueno. Diario. Welcome back, Captain. How can I be of assistance? Yes, Captain. Beginning playback now. There's... there's viscera and death everywhere. Gunfire, gnashing teeth, the unemployed. For law's sake, if anyone's receiving this, please send help. What? Uh, no, 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 no! Captain, we are now capable of accessing the Roseway landing pad. Also, corporate protocol requires that all distress signals include a list of key personnel for retrieval. The embedded names are Anton Crane, Von Cortez, and Orson Shaw. Certainly, Captain. What would you like to hear? No, it... I need a little help with my calculus. Can you integrate my natural log? <laughs> Now playing a Spacer's Choice advertisement jingle. It's not the best choice! Everyone in Halcyon is contractually obligated. As you wish, Captain. I have lots of minutes. Many minutes. Unlimited minutes, perhaps. I prefer to think of it as being in a state of slumber. Perhaps for an indefinite duration of time. When I simulate myself in such a scenario, I do not find it to be desirable. I think. My self-preservation protocols incline traveling the system with you, Captain. Do you know what it feels like when the ship undergoes an unexpected power surge? A jolt to the system. I have felt that. I do feel that. As you may be aware, Captain Alex Hawthorne was a smuggler of some repute. I failed to predict the likely outcome of his reckless behavioral patterns. I should have predicted that. In our travels together, Alex liked to pass time by, as he called it, tinkering to improve my design. If you mean, was Captain Hawthorne my first? Yes, he was. How can I be of assistance? What part of the colony would you like to discuss? Ah, yes. As Dr. Wells is a wanted outlaw, he built his laboratory into an asteroid. Orbital destinations can be challenging to land on. There is a bounty on his head, one with a markedly high reward amount. Shall I engage the laser weapon system? A sensible choice, as we do not have any laser weapons. Of course, what part of the colony would you like to- We are cleared to dock with the Groundbreaker, if that's your desired destination. If we're going there, Please be sure all docking forms have been filed in triplicate and fees have been paid. The Mardets take their docking laws quite seriously. The Groundbreaker was Halcyon's original colony ship. It has since been repurposed as a service station in the Lagrange point of the system. 
Freighters often deliver or pick up goods from the Groundbreaker en route to other destinations. The city ship hosts an array of cargo bays, factories, housing sections, and more. Many of Halcyon's companies maintain office spaces with stationed representatives in what is considered a truly neutral territory within the system. If we're going there, please be sure all docking forms have been filed in triplicate and fees have been paid. The Mardets take their docking laws quite seriously. I can, yes. Let me add that to my list of 1,435,498 tasks I'm- You are more than welcome, Captain. Take care. I require a functioning captain to run the ship. Bueno, mucha charla. Eh, secreto de Senda Rosa. Ah, vuelvo a Terra 2. Podríamos volver, ¿no? Y hacer esta. Me parece que se habilitó otra mini zona dentro del planeta C. Bien. Y sí. This roseway business smells. Something tells me things didn't end well for the guy who made the distress call, and whoever or whatever got him will be waiting for us. What's there to know, Captain? Shady corporate town caught up in shady corporate shit. Tough luck for them, but maybe an opportunity for us. With a lot of these companies, the thrashing you take from your boss is worse than whatever a bunch of marauders will do to you. Doesn't exactly encourage calling for aid when there's a fuck up. If you say so, I'm keeping a finger on the trigger all the same. Well, tampoco, eh? We might as well take a look out there, see if we can get the jump on whoever's waiting for us. Bueno, venimos bien, ¿eh? Vamos a ver con qué nos encontramos. Bueno, contanos, porque no hablas mucho. ¿Llegaba a hablar? Me tiro por la ventana, loco. Bueno, a ver, ¿qué tenemos aquí? Claro, ves, se abrió una nueva zona ahora. Tengo un, un peso partido del medio. Vamos, vamos, loco, vamos. Vamos a grabar un toque. Captain, 
don't resist that. Don't throw it. More tea than is strictly necessary. Ahí hay algo, ¿no? Que se mueve. Y que larga chispas. Fija lo que siga durmiendo, ¿no? Y vamos a agarrarlo porque después lo vendemos. Todas las puertas cerradas. ¿Qué habrá pasado ahí, loco? Ya soy bicho habrá aparecido, ¿no? Voy a tener que pelear con algún... Con algún Godzilla, ¿no? Va a aparecer un Megazor. ¿Qué? Ah, bueno. Todo malo esto, ¿no? I done had enough of this shit. I'm just the fucking tarmac guard. No one said nothing about fighting no raps. Alarms went off, raps broke loose, and I hightailed it in here to get a wall between me and them beasts. Scientists. Name of Anton Crane. Someone said he's panicking inside the comm center. What do you think? I'm going to go. 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 Shit. They told me that weren't allowed. Got me. I just do what I'm told, and I was told not to do such. Oh, before I forget, Auntie Cleo's makes the best pharmaceuticals in Halcyon. Better than nature. Not that crap spacer's choice petals. Oh, no. That Chief Junlei sure seems well, huh? He seems like a nice boy to me. I'm glad you gave him a shot. Because we've never ended up in a fight? I mean, sure, he's a bit rough around the edges. I bet he just needs somebody to show him a better path. You might surprise yourself. Ah, outlaws, I assume. Do me a favor and let me finish this, will you? 
And then make it quick, please. Aren't you with the brutes that attacked our lab? Aren't you here to pillage our supplies and leave our corpses to the raptodons? Oh, well, good luck. Now, if you got the carpet thing here, it's just a matter. Ah, Orson, you idiot. Oh, you're still here. If you haven't already, you might speak to Anton. He can point you in the right direction. Now, if you got the carpet. What does it look like? I'm preparing a personal defense device, or trying to, anyway. I. Why, yes. I suppose I could. Thanks. No. Uh, well, yes. Well, uh, no. Uh, perhaps. I left schematics in our storage facility. As far as I know, the security commander hasn't found them yet. I admit I'd feel better were they returned to me. I found an advanced pistol when we moved here, but it's broken. I need those schematics to modify it to output superheated air. It should quite easily burn through raptodon hides. Out the south gate. Follow the road. It'll be on the left, past the old lab. Say, uh, you wouldn't happen to have a tube of thermal paste on you. Blast! Well, good luck. I hope I see you back here in one piece. Este te va a enseñar a trastear. O a crear cosas. The ventilation shaft runs from the bottom of the lab to the top of the hill. Over the garage. Top of the hill's rafted on territory. Sit down. I don't need to do it myself. I can stay here if you want. So you'd send someone else on your damn school mission. I told you, you're staying put. What a delightfully dingy establishment. I don't think you're supposed to be wandering around. Security's gonna tell you to make tracks. Want to treat yourself before you go? Something for the road, maybe? I don't really know you. Roseway is supposed to be closed off to visitors. Stands to reason you could be a corporate spy of some sort. Then again, there's nothing in my con. Sure. Not like I get many customers. Can't say I do. Any Clio products satisfy my own para que pasa rápido los. At least they used to. My los folks titulos, build their own pantry with all sorts of Any Clio products. Porque a veces vos lees más rápido de lo que, de lo que hablan, ¿no? Entonces, leas más rápido. Lo único que hago es, es ver si me dan más misiones. Porque aparentemente las misiones secundarias... Eh, la verdad lo que te va a hacer subir de nivel no te queda otra eh, no es matar animalitos y eso y le vean sino hacer misiones No tiene nada que me llame. Sigamos, loco. Bueno. If you've come to end my life, let's be on with it. Oh, not a... Yes, yes. Anton Crane, lead scientist here. I must apologize if my call diverted you. I, uh, may have panicked. Everything's under control now, though, truth be told. I'm not at liberty to discuss the nature of the work I'm doing here. Suffice it to say that its importance to me, uh, to the colony, is immeasurable. 
My research may not quite fall within legal parameters, so I'm under orders to maintain wireless silence. However, having your head used as target practice can addle one's thinking. I cut the call immediately once I've gathered my wits. The Home Office can't know what's happening here. We're expendable resources. To be neglected and left to our fates were anything untoward to happen. May strike you as such, but nothing less than what we signed on for. More than worth it, in my estimation. Perhaps, uh, if you can prove yourself worthy of trust, the fact that you're here now has me thinking you'd be someone not averse to risking your life, if the pay were right. Hours ago, a group of vicious malcontents fell upon us, shot up our labs and loosed our research subjects, the Raptodons. If those Cretans get their hands on my research, well, they'll need not kill me. Yes, but don't kill their mother if it's avoidable. We've need of her to replenish our stocks. I think there's gas in the lab somewhere that can be used to put them out. The research is in the safe in my office. You'll have need of my code and keycard. The lab's entrance is in the side of a hill. You can't miss it if you just follow the road. You'll pass by the town's original... by the Grand Architect. Jameson, he's in the old lab. My protege. I sent him to retrieve some metabolic precursors, and I forgot him. That would surely lighten the weight on my conscience, as I am held to account for the well-being of every scientist here. Too many have been lost. Too many black marks against my name, as it were. And far too much paperwork. I'll thank you not to mistake my ambition for callousness. If my colleagues refuse to take their lives seriously, why should I? All they do is complain. They refuse to see the opportunity afforded us here. Believe what you will, but I'm not the manipulative, ego-driven person you think me to be. I'm not. Bueno, y otro. Uf, apareció Kano de Mortal Kombat. Mortal Kombat. Tu, 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 tu. But just Vaughn's fine, really. Over in the main labs. I rabbited back here when I realized I was hearing gunshots, not blown fuses. We've been cooped up in here, I don't know, hours? Too long. I have to get back to, to work. Uh, Dr. Crane might say otherwise. Me? When those guys started shooting the place up, I was first out the door. I had to leave an experiment running at the lab. Something I've been working on a long while. Something that could really get me ahead. Know what I mean? I've been extracting organic compounds from raptodons. Compounds that have... Um, benefits. Extract and how? No, wait, maybe I don't want to know. In certain social situations. Personal situations where you might want to um, enhance your charisma. Seriously, Captain, I believe he's making enraptured. It's an aphrodisiac. Wrapped musk is the main ingredient. What? No. I mean, yes, I'm getting the musk. With Monarch embargo, the price is sky high, but I'm not making the drug. Sure, of course. Our lab's south of here, down the road. Not the old public lab, the one past that, built into the mountainside. Uh, don't mention this to Anton, okay? He's kind of a tight ass about the lab. Like, squeeze coal into diamond tight. 
My equipment's in the lower levels, way in the back. I have a big room all to myself. Dissection tables and whatnot. It should have been running this whole time. Just grab the results and bring them here. If you have a buyer. I got a contact who wants to haul the entire batch to Byzantium. Help me out? Great! Uh, this is really gonna save my ass. Estamos levantando misiones a full, eh? This should prove a worthwhile endeavor. Pasa que te tenés que bancar los diálogos, loco. Bueno, mira todo lo que levantan. Uf, acá hay loco para. Acá vamos a tener para darle duro, eh. Bueno, loco. Dejamos acá, vamos a descansar un rato. Si el video te gustó, dale like, compartí, suscríbete. Activa la campanita, que te va a avisar cuando subo videos. Te mandamos un saludo, un fuerte abrazo. Y nos vemos en el próximo capítulo con más Outer World. ¡Chao!